There was a groundbreaking for a new center to teach technical skills. Dunseat's new $15 million career and technology center will soon be under construction. Lauren Davis tells us what this means for job growth in the region. On Thursday, there was a groundbreaking for the new career and technology center, which is right across from Dunseith High School. It gives our students uh, industry certified certification coming right out of high school, and so they'll be employable, hit the workforce, trained, ready to go in different areas such as welding or plumbing or we had the RV tech, uh, health careers, uh, food service. There was also a cultural prayer and dance to honor the land where this new center will be before construction begins. One of our medicines we use is the Kniknik, the tobacco, and we offer that so that you know we let them know what we're going to be doing and why we're doing it we make an offering and so we would do that to earth mother because you're going to be disturbing her when you go in and you start building on her so so let her let them know what's happening the project has an estimated price of 15 million dollars and the center is expected to be completed by next year it's quite an interest already and a lot, a lot of that comes through word of mouth and through excitement um, uh, other kids we, we have a great population of hands-on uh, students and they like to work with their hands and build things and so this is going to, this is just up their alley. The center will also have a training program for the Hofer RV manufacturing plant where students will be able to learn skills to be an RV technician. This helps students prepare for a stable career right in town thanks to a one-of-a-kind program. The first high school in North America to be able to get this level two program running which is also going to have state high school credits, I think that's wonderful because this is a program that was initially designed for technical colleges and now we're bringing it down to that grade 9 to 12 level. And if this program is successful, Hofer says these types of opportunities will only grow here in North Dakota. For KX News in Dunseith, I'm Lauren Davis. Hofer says the training program will create a feeder system for students to be able to work at the manufacturing plant after completing the program.